I read it after she died, and then a couple of years later, I was approached by a producer completely unrelated to Pat. I met the author when I was a kid working at the New York Times. I was a researcher, and I suggested her to the magazine editors as someone who could do a walking tour of uh, Greenwood Cemetery. She happened to be in town, Patricia Highsmith, and accepted. And as a sort of reward or punishment, I'm not sure which, I was sent with her to the cemetery. And that very strange visit resulted in a decade-long friendship that ended only when she died. I tend to read something, read it again, read it obsessively, make obsessive notes, not so much about plot, but about how to preserve a tone. And I don't really write for a long time. And then it will call, all come together in a couple of weeks.